In this video, I'll show you how you can fix Elder Scrolls from crashing on PC. Now, the first thing you could try is to actually go to Steam and then right click on Elder Scrolls, go to properties, and then go to general, and you're gonna go to the launch options. And you're going to type minus DX12. This is for people who actually run DX12. Now, let's say you don't have DX12, but instead you still have DX11. What you could try instead is to actually change it to 11 and try and run it that way. Now, the second method you could try is to go to Elder Scrolls again, go to properties, go to installed files, and go to verify this game files are installed correctly and click on integrity of game files this will check for missing or corrupt files that prevents you from launching the game or that makes the game crash the third method you could try is to go to properties again go to install files click on browse right click on .x file go to properties go to compatibility mode and try and disable full screen optimizations because i have had situations where full screen was preventing the game from launching properly or it somehow crashed the game so and i click on apply now if that doesn't work you could go again to the .x file, right click, go to properties and instead go to compatibility and turn on run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8. Now this will make the game a lot slower unfortunately but this might be some of the few uh, things left for you to try that can fix your game from crashing. And on top of that we're going to try and run this program as an administrator and then click on apply. And now let's say that didn't work either, what you can do is go to search on your PC and type Windows update settings and you can try and check whether or not there's any updates available on your PC to make sure you don't have an outdated drive. Now the same counts for your game drive. Me personally, I use Nvidia. So I'm gonna type Nvidia and I click on the app. And if we go to the left, we can see drivers. I'm gonna click on that. And we can see that there is indeed an update available for our drivers. You can even see what specifically it is for. You can see here, this time it's for Black Myth and another game. And occasionally you are going to actually see Elder Scrolls in there as well. But regardless, it's always best to just update your drivers. 